Hey, what's up? You're looking fancy. It is kind of weird that a bunch of teenagers are uh, the head of the uh, nationwide news center. Anyway, Duking has uh, discovered spots where wild Pokemon appear, which is crazy whack off the heezy here in this town. Because this place is just so desolate, there are no wild Pokemon. Alright, remember the item, remember the item, remember the item. Hey! Hey, Mr. Cutscene, you're interrupting me. Oh gee, a boss? Oh my, I wonder who that is. Man, it's totally iron. I'm sure of it. Anyway, grab the item, grab the item. Uh, there is a Coliseum challenge, you can uh, participate in it. You can beat it at this point. I know, I've tried. Um, and you'll get Brick Break as a reward. But uh, none of my Pokemon can learn Brick Break, so I'm like, I'm not gonna bother with it at this point. Maybe later. Anyway, hi all you guys. I'm not sure if you're a Shadow Pokemon or not. I'll have to look that up. But I have more important business to attend to right now. Specifically, uh, Bokeh Snacks. And off we go. Pofty? That almost sounds like Poffin, but there's no way they planned that. Oh my god. You look atrocious. God, I'm not sure which is worse. The, his subtly gay pose, his extremely tight muscle tight shirt or his really weird mustache I don't know hey, hey what's up okay this is real complicated you put the snacks on here uh, the more you leave the longer the Pokemon will stay on there but uh, if you just go for it as soon as it happens you'll have enough time generally Thank you for giving me free stuff! So the spot monitor, uh... It'll pop up an alert when a Pokemon appears at any spot. Any of the three spots, eventually. Um, but it won't tell you which one. So you have to actually go and onto the monitor and see which one, which one is reacting. And here we are on the Oasis one. We'll leave one there. Once he's done talking to us. Alright, fine. Okay, these three Pokemon are, I believe, the rarest ones to pop up at the Pokemon Poke spots. And uh, if you catch them, you can trade them to him to uh, get a different Pokemon. One of them's Larutar, I don't remember the other ones. I'm not going to use any of them. I'm going to leave new one again. Uh, there are three different Pokemon that can pop, at, pop up at any of them. Just if you're wondering. Hey, you guys. Well, at least... At least the guy with the stupid hat doesn't bug me quite as much in this game. 
Alright, what's up? Well, why is he wearing a life preserver, I wonder? That is the best radar. Or the best music, I guess. Golly. Put on a shirt. Like, you're cool and all, but put on a shirt. This is the best chance. So normally a trope is but thou must, but uh, this is but thou mustn't. But at least they gave you the illusion of choice, unlike Nugget Bridge. And Mirror B has gotten a new theme song in this game. I'm, I'm torn between the two, honestly, because this one's groovy. And I love groovy. The other one's hot fiesta, ba battle, energizing. Both great in their own ways, and I can't choose between them. But he is still up to his old tricks with the Lombre and the Ludicolo and all that. No Ludicolo at this point, but it'll happen later. It's gonna be enough thanks to the healing there. Oh, we'll take that back. It is kind of jarring how people have gotten weaker. Ooh, quick attack, sweet. That will replace tackle, and still probably be pretty useless. Sweet. And double level up. Lombre's change level or get higher level. Nope, still level 17. No issues. Now, luckily, his Shadow Pokemon is not a Lombre or a Lotad or whatever. It's actually completely unrelated and it kind of comes out of nowhere. The one who actually needed to heal didn't use it. But yeah, I would recommend using like a flying move. Have some sort of super effective move against these guys. Because experiencing Coliseum taught me that they are pain tedious to deal with if you don't have something super effective. And there's Altor, that's our Shadow Pokemon. I like how the icon fits perfectly in the little icon slot. That priority take care of Lombre. That could have done more. Could have been worse, I guess. And Lombre is down, we are free to start snagging. We're only free to before, but now it's a better idea. And the wave in there. Mudslap in there. Mudslap is useful for snagging, I guess. Sort of. I'll probably get rid of it for something actually useful later. Actually, while I'm thinking of it, uh, Shroomish, the Shadow Shroomish you got a little earlier, actually really, really good for smacking, because uh, you can get like status moves, Stun Spore, Sleep Powder, etc. Um, do that. But uh, it can also get False Swipe once it's purified, so you know, get it to like 1 HP and then snag it and you're good to go. Very, very useful, especially since Breloom 
That's pretty good offense. And get into snagging range. Throw the ball this turn. I bought a couple more balls off screen. I wanted more than one premier ball just in case I failed at catching my next team member with it. Gotcha! One of one for this area? No, 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 no. I guess it depends on if you count the non shadow Pokemon you can snag. Everything about Mirror B is awesome. 